take me down to where the river ends. Everything we've done to date has been entirely self-produced, and I think that's something that's kind of special and unique about Quiet Corral. And, and um, Jim is so gifted with audio engineering that we've been playing catch up to be able to perform those songs as well as he was able to record them. Take me down to where the river meets the sea. I go back and forth every day between wanting to make an album that sounds big budget and then wanting to make an album that doesn't sound big budget and sounds just like what we are and what we do. I hope that it's a good mix of that. I'm gonna follow the water. I'm gonna follow the water. I'm gonna follow the water. Follow the water home. Oh, I'm gonna follow the water. I'm gonna follow the water. This, this album is a better representation of what you're gonna get when you come to a Quiet Corral show. Oh, I'm gonna follow the water. I'm gonna follow the water. I'm gonna follow the water. And some music is great to, to cook to, to vacuum the house to, to put on in the background, and that's great too. I've always listened to music in the foreground. I'm gonna follow the water, follow the water home. Those are the type of albums that I love listening to five, ten years later that stick with me for a year and I listen to hundreds of times in my car. It would be awesome if people listen to this album that way. Feeling low, feeling low, hold out for the hope that the bottom of each street is a travel gravel road.